being the member of a special biological family is uh, many times the reason why someone becomes a celebrity. And being part of this special biological family or being a celebrity is uh, many times the reason why someone got the opportunity to use this uh, special egg donor or this special sperm donor. And within their close network, they probably know that uh, this person is uh, in family with this person. But to, to the official world, this is hidden. Therefore, this celebrity cannot look too much like that celebrity, even though they are in family, because this is supposed to be hidden towards the official world. However, their height is kind of proof to this close network that these people belong in the same biological family. So, in the celebrity world, a height is not just a height if you put this next to their popularity, which indicate that they should be part of a special and biological family. So, let's start with my biological brother, Christian Jessen. He has the height of his mother, which is 188. Another person which has the height uh, 188 and which uh, seem uh, to be a little bit too popular to not be part of some special and biological family is uh, Ryan Reynolds. So maybe he looks a bit like his official mom and dad. Maybe he just looks like his official dad. Maybe he looks a bit like Christian Jessen and my other brothers. Maybe the mom of Christian Jessen and my other brothers was an egg donor. Or maybe they in other ways are related to my biological brothers. However, there is less than five months in between the birth of Ryan Reynolds and the birth of Christian Jessen. Therefore, the mom of Christian Jessen and my other brothers could not carry through with the pregnancy of uh, Ryan Reynolds and Christian Jessen. And if uh, she is the mom of uh, both of them, she must have been an egg donor. Because, you know, this world is centralized around very few biological families. Another person, which is uh, 188 and uh, which is a little bit too popular to not be part of uh, some special and biological family, is Elon Musk. In addition, Elon Musk does not have the height of his mom or his dad. Therefore, he must have another biological parent. And Elon Musk do not look like Christian Jessen, which looks like his biological mom. But uh, Elon Musk looks like his dad. And 
and sometimes someone might also look like their official mom even though that is not their biological mom because they picked that mom accordingly or maybe the mom of my brothers has a brother which they use as a sperm donor and in fact uh, his mom is his biological mom and uh, not his dad but uh, then uh, this uh, brother of uh, their mother needs to have the same height 188 Elon Musk has uh, a name which is kind of similar to my name, Elin Madeleine. Moving on to the next step in this family tree, I kind of want to connect Blake Lavely with the Olsen twins. While Simon Sinek has the same height as Blake Lavely, and I kind of want to connect uh, Simon Sinek to Christian Jessen. His name is not Simon, but Simon. But Simon is the Norwegian version of this name and the name which people are using when they are named after Simon Sinek. Therefore, it is easy to exchange these names. However, it would be a bit strange to have the name Simon in the UK which is very easy for me to understand but I just did not think about it because uh, I am satisfied when people is going to understand what I am saying however I'm probably going to use the name Simon in the rest of this video moving on to the next step in this family tree I kind of want to connect Blake Lavely with the Olsen twins while Simon Sinek has the same height as Blake Lavely, and I kind of want to connect uh, Simon Sinek to Christian Jessen. However, uh, Ryan Reynolds and Blake Lavely cannot be in the same family because they are in a relationship. Therefore, uh, Simon Sinek uh, and Christian Jessen might look like this third person and uh, they might not uh, actually look like each other or this uh, observation that they look uh, like each other is just wrong because sometimes this half sibling might look like this half sibling which looks like this half sibling but these two people which is not half siblings do not look like each other but I'm connecting them to each other's appearance by this uh, person in between However, this observation that uh, these two people look like each other through this third person could be wrong. However, it is very common that this uh, one person from this uh, biological and popular family is uh, together with a person from this other biological and uh, popular family. So, why am I connecting Blake Lavely to the Olsen twins and not Elizabeth? Maybe because the appearance of the Olsen twins and Elizabeth is a bit different. And maybe I am connecting the appearance of Blake Lavely to the Olsen twins through the appearance of this third person. Because uh, Blake Lavely and the Olsen twins do not look like each other. However, I am a bit unsure about the real reason why I am connecting Blake Lavely to the Olsen twins because I've tried to look for someone which could connect their appearances together but I have uh, failed to find uh, this person so maybe the reason why I'm connecting them together is uh, that I have picked up something else uh, from uh, the media
But if Blake Lively is in family with the Olsen twins, she is also in family with me and uh, Elizabeth Olsen. Because uh, we share the same mother. Simon Oliver Sinek and uh, Blake Lively has the height uh, 178. And that is uh, the same height as Elvis Presley. And through a name analysis of the name Oliver, as in uh, Simon Oliver Sinek and uh, Lively, as in Blake Lively, this name is kind of similar to Elvis. Also, the name uh, Lively, as in Blake Lively, is uh, similar to the last name of Elvis Presley. The height of the family to Blake Lively reveal that uh, it is likely that uh, Blake Lively is adopted. Well, Simon uh, Sinek uh, kind of looks like he has the head shape uh, and the nose of uh, Elvis Presley. And if you analyze uh, the name Ashley, as in Ashley Olsen, that name is uh, very similar to the last name of Elvis Presley. So, in accordance with the age of Elvis Presley and the fact that he is not our dad, uh, I think that Elvis Presley is our grandfather. However, uh, the height of our mom is 168 and not... Uh, 178 as Elvis Presley. Therefore, the height of her grandmother must be 168. Another person which is 168 and which had uh, the power position to use her dad as a sperm donor is uh, Chris Jenner. Therefore, I think that she is the sister of our biological mom. However, the appearance of uh, Chris Jenner or biological mom and Elvis Presley is so different uh, that uh, Chris Jenner and our biological mom cannot have two shared parents. Therefore, and in accordance with the name analysis of the name Ashley, Elvis Presley is uh, probably the father of our mother, but not the father of uh, Chris Jenner. And Chris Jenner has the name Chris Mary Jenner, while our biological mom has the nickname Kate. And uh, by combining uh, these two names, you have the name uh, Mary Kate, which is the name of uh, the daughter of our biological mom and my sister. Also, a very popular celebrity here in Norway has the name Siv Jensen. And the name Siv is uh, similar to the name Elvis. And lately, I've gotten very few hate comments because I have restricted the ability other people have to send me hate comments. And for some reason, no one is contacting me on Facebook. But there has been one person contacting me on Facebook with the name Per Jensen. The name Per is similar to Presley, as in Elvis Presley, while the last name Jensen is connecting this to Siv Jensen, which is a front name which is similar to Elvis. Our biological mom looks like the Olsen twins and Elizabeth. Therefore, our grandmother also needs to look like our biological mom, because uh, 
or biological mom do not look like Elvis. So let's take a look on the noses of uh, the daughters of our biological mom because so far I have only identified that she has daughters. Maybe because this look is more suitable in a human trafficking perspective. Her daughter Sarah Paulson is assumed to have the nose of her biological dad because uh, she has uh, the same dad as uh, Courtney Kardashian and uh, they have the same nose. Danielle Fischel is assumed to have the same dad as Sarah Paulson but Danielle Fischel do not have the same nose as Sarah Paulson. Therefore, Danielle Fischel should have the nose of our biological mom. And that means that Margaret, Ashley and Elizabeth, which all looks like their mom, has the nose of their dad. Yeah, like, I was not expecting that when they had the, the look of their mom, all three. I was assuming that they probably also had her nose. But uh, if Danielle Fischel has uh, the nose of her mom and uh, Mercate Ashley and Elizabeth has the nose of her dad, what the fuck happened to my nose? To get a better understanding of this, we should probably take a look uh, on the noses of my siblings, with Danielle Fischel having the same nose as Elvis Presley. Danielle Fischel has a bigger nose which goes out towards the side, while uh, Merikit, Ashley and Elizabeth has a smaller nose, like me, but uh, which is narrow, while my nose goes out towards the sides. The nose tip of uh, Danielle Fischel and Ashley goes kind of downwards, while the nose tip of me and uh, Merkit and uh, Elizabeth uh, kind of goes upwards. And I'm like, why the fuck do my nose go out towards the side uh, when I have a small nose like Merkit, Ashley and Elizabeth, but uh, they do not have a nose which goes out towards the sides. And uh, then I'm like, oh, maybe my ears become so big that it dragged the, the nose out towards the sides. Or maybe I have placed Danielle Fischel at the wrong location in the family tree and she is in fact uh, the sister of our biological mom and uh, not her daughter and uh, I have the notes of our biological dad while Margaret, Ashley and Elizabeth which has a more similar nose has the nose of our biological mom. So what I actually think happened is that you get a nose which is uh, something in between the nose of your mom and your dad uh, or uh, a complete replica. So that uh, Danielle Fischel is uh, the daughter of our biological mom and our sister after all. Because there is a small difference between the noses of Elvis Presley and Danielle Fischel. Well, there also is a small difference between the noses of Merkit, Ashley and Elizabeth. Well, with my nose there is a more remarkable difference. So my nose has a tip like uh, the nose of uh, Merkit and Elizabeth, uh, while my nose uh, goes out towards the sides uh, like the nose of Danielle. But then again, my nose is uh, more narrow than uh, the nose of all of these people. <laughs> but uh, then again, people have asked me why I have this nose, like why is your nose so skinny? I'm like, why the fuck are you being so rude? And uh, probably someone has also commented on the fact that my nose goes out towards the sides. You're like, why is this nose so strange? And uh, that like really hurt my feelings because I'm like, I have a personality. Why the fuck are you commenting on my nose? 
and uh, sometimes genetical errors occur so that the human race evolve maybe that was what happened anyhow since this nose kind of separates me from my siblings uh, people might be a bit occupied uh, with uh, this nose because I feel like I've seen this news uh, so somewhere else. I'm like, yeah, there is something very familiar with this nose. Where have I seen this nose before? A nose which goes out to heads the sides. Oh yeah, I think I Oh yeah, I think I remember now. This is where I've seen this news before. So these characters is from uh, the television program uh, Mumi Doll, uh, which is uh, translated to Mumi Valley, which was sent on uh, the television when I was a little child. And uh, some of these characters was uh, pretty damn scary. Oh, so yeah, like uh, comparing my nose to these uh, trolls in this television program, <laughs> maybe. And uh, something which is kind of confirming this theory is that uh, someone influenced me to have uh, Lille Me, this uh, one character from uh, Mumi Doll, on my russekort, which is translated to uh, Russe card, uh, which is uh, something we have in uh, Norway uh, sometime during uh, the school years. So you can be a Rus the last school year before you go off to college, which for me was uh, before I was an apprentice. When you are a Rus, you have this uh, red, blue or black costume and uh, you deliver out this uh, Russe card. And uh, you do a lot of stupid activities which is uh, supposed to be funny. And when you do these uh, funny activities, uh, you get this uh, thing to have in your hat. Yeah, and sometimes these activities might be funny, sometimes it is just humiliating because I have like these uh, normal feelings. Anyhow, I think that we have uh, established the fact that I have a strange nose uh, compared to my siblings. But now back to Elvis Presley. I think that uh, our biological uh, grandmother, which uh, was uh, using uh, Elvis as a sperm donor, uh, that she has the name uh, or had the name Olsen, which makes our biological mom into a Olsen Presley. And I had this friend on Facebook uh, with the name uh, Johnny Olsen. And that makes me think about uh, Johnny Depp because uh, he is uh, currently very visible in the media. So is this an uh, indication that uh, Johnny Depp is a uh, Olsen? Because just like Elvis Presley, Johnny Depp is uh, 178 uh, centimeters. And uh, his name, Johnny, is uh, written exactly the same way as uh, this friend I had on Facebook. However, Johnny Depp does not look like our grandmother or Elvis Presley, therefore uh, this has to be uh, connected. Uh, by some other relative. Maybe Elvis Presley and uh, some other mom. And uh, when I hereby used uh, 
word mom i was referring to uh, that uh, another person uh, used uh, elvis presley as the sperm donor and that this might be uh, the grandmom of uh, uh, johnny depp but in order for johnny depp to be a olsen this uh, person which was using uh, elvis presley as a sperm donor and uh, which might be the grandmother of uh, johnny depp uh, must be a uh, Olsen as well and uh, therefore uh, maybe the sister of our grandmother but be aware that some people want to hide the truth therefore the height of these celebrities given on the internet might vary but based on the information given in this video I think that the height of the celebrities given in this video is correct on this list of celebrities, which is 178 centimeters, I found Elvis Presley. So maybe he was placed on a list where he do not belong to. Or someone is changing the internet because they know what I am doing and they want to hide the truth. Because now I cannot find the height of uh, 178 centimeters. Uh, next to the name of Elvis Presley anywhere. So maybe I am wrong. Maybe the height of 178 centimeters is the height of uh, the grandmother to Johnny Depp, uh, Blake Lively and uh, Simon Sinek. Or maybe this in other ways uh, is related. However, there is a lot of information given in this video which indicate that what I am saying is the truth. This is the height which was available for Elvis Presley the last time I checked. So, uh, who was uh, this uh, song uh, really all about? She was a good girl, crazy about Elvis. Yeah, that might be a song about uh, some of my uh, family members. Maybe that was a song about uh, our grandmother being uh, excited about using uh, Elvis as a sperm donor. Or maybe that is uh, a song about our biological mom being uh, a fan of uh, her dad. And excuse me if that is a song which is not very suitable to sing about uh, uh, their dad, but uh, I do not know this uh, song very well. And even though I'm a lot more sensitive than uh, our biological mom, there is a certain difference between uh, Chris Jenner and our biological mom. So I'm sorry Chris Jenner, but uh, compared to our biological mom, I think that uh, our biological mom is uh, going to look like a good girl. Growing up, I have heard these two stories. You drive the car just like Martin Skanke because you know I'm not driving carefully enough or they just want to point out that uh, this uh, person has this name and that is somehow related to me and I have heard this story that uh, where uh, where you when uh, Elvis died yeah these two stories and guess what? The last name of my biological dad is Skanke. And uh, the last name of uh, my biological mom is Presley. Because Elvis Presley is her dad. And uh, while I've been working on uh, this uh, video about uh, Elvis Presley being my grandfather and my camera on my phone has been totally useless and I have to turn off and on uh, the telephone uh, 
constantly. So does that mean that someone is trying to prevent me from sharing that information and uh, that they therefore have accessed my interface? Because it is strange that this uh, disappears when I turn uh, off and on the telephone without uh, doing any changes to the telephone. <laughs>